My dear friends, nearly a century ago, a family from Oregon was vacationing in Indiana, over 2,000 miles away, when they lost their beloved dog, Bobby. The frantic family searched for the dog everywhere, but to no avail. Bobby could not be found. Heartbroken, they made the trip home, each mile taking them farther away from their cherished pet. Six months later, the family was stunned to find Bobby on their doorstep in Oregon. Mangy, scrawny, feet worn to the bone, he appeared to have walked the entire distance by himself. Bobby's story captured the imagination of people across the United States and he became known as Bobby the Wonder Dog. Bobby is not the only animal who baffled scientists with an amazing sense of direction and instinct for home. Some monarch butterfly populations migrate 3,000 miles each year to climbs better suited for their survival. Leatherback turtles travel across the Pacific Ocean from Indonesia to the coast of California. Humpback whales swim from the cold waters of the North Pole and South Poles toward the equator and back. Perhaps even more incredibly, the Arctic tern flies from the Arctic Circle to Antarctica and back every year, some 60,000 miles. When scientists study this fascinating behavior, they ask questions such as, how do they know where to go? And how does each successive generation learn this behavior? When I read of this powerful instinct in animals, I can't help but wonder, is it possible that human beings have a similar yearning, an inner guidance system, if you will, that draws them to their heavenly home? I believe that every man, woman, and child has felt the call of heaven at some point in his or her life. Deep within us is a longing to somehow reach past the veil and embrace heavenly parents we once knew and cherished. Some might suppress this yearning and deaden their souls to its call. But those who do not quench this light within themselves can embark on an incredible journey, a wondrous migration towards heavenly climes.